I feel like at this point we've all cried at least once or twice over Wizard 101 before. I know for me personally, I cry like every week over this game. <laughs> Maybe I'm just a very emotional person. But I asked you guys on Twitter to name off some of the things in Wizard 101 that make you guys cry. So we're gonna read those off. Name something in Wizard 101 that can make you cry this hard. Go. Pax. Honestly, valid. I I feel like I've definitely cried over pack openings before. Maybe not like recently, but like whenever I was a kid, I think I've definitely cried over pack openings. Probably because I wanted like a pet or something. Like I I didn't even care about the gear back then. Divin Whiteheart's death, but we did get a good shot of his feet. Stop. You're awful. Dude, this is so messed up. I literally don't even pay attention to questing. I didn't even know that he died. And I hate his feet. Old school Liz spending three hours in Brisk Breeze only to die with no, rungeon, no dungeon root. What the hell is Brisk Breeze? Am I stupid or something? I literally have no idea what this is. I mean, like, it looks like it's in Colossus Boulevard, but, like, what was the purpose of this? Oh my god, I guess I'm just, like, not an OG player. But that does suck, and I'm so sorry. Accidentally clicking pick up all items in my decorating project. I have also fallen victim to this before and that, ooh, that is a pain unlike no other. Seriously, that that like is enough to make you just completely log off. Okay, it's so like another Divim Whiteheart's death. Like I, I'm starting to realize that I must not be a good Wiz player because like I didn't even know he died. And I've completed Chrysalis like probably eight times already. Maybe more because I, I delete characters sometimes. But yeah, I just like don't pay attention. Oh my god. You guys are calling me out right now. I can't believe I've cried like this over Wiz and don't remember why exactly. I just remember I did. Okay, like also valid. There have been so many times that I've cried like this over Wiz. Like in this picture, I <laughs> I was just crying over Wiz because I love it like those are just tears of like genuine joy for this game even though I hate it sometimes lol when someone doesn't crit and it results in a raid loss okay that literally is like this literally happened to us shout out to limbo for not critting oh my god we wasted like three hours and we lost every single time anyway when my stitch and rate my stitch goes from 10 to 6 stars can't relate I'm pretty sure I'm like number 24 on the leaderboards lol Dint? Who's Dint? The first Dint, not the second Dint. I love second. Who is Dint? Oh my god. Okay. Like, I, I recognize this guy. I just didn't know that was his name. Anyway, this one's kind of hot. This one's kind of not. I don't know which one's the first, but I, I would cry for this one too if I looked like that. But if I looked like this... I think I would have all of the ladies clicking plow all instead of plant all on my glitched 69 plot garden and then having 25% disappear then thinking about taking the entire thing down and redoing it. Damn, that's never happened to me, but I I think I would just stop playing with being banned. Okay, that's relatable because I actually did get banned and I did cry like this, so that's relatable. It was a long time ago though. Like this was like 20 like I don't even know. 2016 or something when you run out of spells and then the boss is on one HP. Oh my god Okay, whenever that happens to me, I just like get a henchman But not everyone's fortunate enough to have 50 crowns to spare and like you don't want to get the level 20 ones Because they'll just die immediately. But yeah, that does suck the paywall like Getting the ad theme to drop at graveyard. Oh my god. Yeah, I have done like four different no 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 let's be real i think i've done more like eight different two hour streams farming graveyard just for that ad theme which i don't even use anymore pet failed at mega for the 69th time relatable solo balance not relatable for me because i don't even play on my balance and when i do i get carried lol not relatable for me but I'm sure that does suck. But at least you get Sandstorm though. Like think about deaths and lives. They don't even have an AoE. That's that's actually not relatable at all. Solo balance, that should be that should be easy. Being second in a fight and then they earthquake the round you hit. Okay, yeah, yeah. Losing an account that you worked so hard on and charging you $90 to get it back. Oof, oh my god. Wizard 101, get your act together. This is happening to so many people. When the crown seal and crown award event is actually beneficial and worth it for the player base. Yeah, that makes you cry tears of joy. My 14-7 resist pet failing five times in 10 minutes. If 
you managed to get Aeon gear from the final boss in Novus and you accidentally trashed it. Oh my god! I'm pretty sure I did this with, um, it was the final boss in Novus, but I was getting rid of all of my masterpiece gear, which I didn't know you could use to craft into eternal gear, so. Playing through Azteca, true. Going into a dungeon only to find you have to fight Bellic for the- <laughs> He's always there. He's literally always there. Niles being alone in Croc. That is so sad. Just logging in. <laughs> True. Still not having the Hydra Mount after all these years. I don't think I do either. Trying to farm more Master before finding out drops were changed. Oh my god. Pretty sure I also did this. Until I was like, wait a second. Wait a minute. Hearing the comments theme after not playing for six years. It really do be hitting different. Although I've been playing consecutively for the past like 12 years, so. But even me logging on and hearing it, it just like, it's different. Dark more drop rates. Boat mount, which can be dropped on key boss, but costs 12k crowns in the shop. <laughs> you gotta just know what is a good deal and what's not. Trying to solo anything on your pirate. <laughs> what do you mean? Your pyromancer? <laughs> Let me unlike that. What do you mean? Me, if the Polaris World Elixir cost $50 worth of crowns, that would not be worth it. The only two worlds that I think would act, well, okay, maybe three worlds that I think would actually be worth an elixir are Azteca, Chrysalis, and Imperia. The end of Chrysalis. I'm assuming this is another reference to Divim dying. I'm assuming. Forgetting an alt account's password and username after not using it for years that had important things on it. <laughs> Guys, just trust cybersecurity world one underscore underscore wide. Send him a direct message for your alt account password recovery. That's all you have to do, Nathan. That's all you have to do. Constant pet fails, seeing Azteca. On my first quiz years ago, I soloed a very tough dungeon and got stuck on an infinite loop of being dead, having my henchman heal me a teeny tiny amount and dying again and not being able to flee because my henchman cast before I can hit flee. <laughs> it was awful. Seeing the old Wizard 101 commercials knowing that the game graphics will never be up to par. Or just like seeing the old Wizard 101 commercials in general knowing that they will never ever make real commercials again. I swear, like they knew how to market back then but they just don't anymore. Earthquake. When a pet fails consistently with stats and you have to restart. Fizzing for the third time in a row. Doing PvP back in 2010. Oh yeah, that made me cry. <laughs> a happy cry for you, not me. You must have been good at it then, I wasn't. Buying a membership to work on a new character and one week later, KI making the first arc free. The fact that they stopped making cool or decent looking world gear in order to push more packs. True, now it's all like ugly. I think the last cool world gear stopped at like Dragon's Fire. But I guess it's really just a matter of opinion. Suffering in crystals with the fire wizard. Buying membership and then two weeks later as well, first arc is free. Yeah, I had that before. Why were you crying there? I was in a battle, okay, here, look, hold on. I was on stream, I was in a battle, and I had three of my friends next to me, and we were all just like having a good time questing, and it really just got me in the feels. Like, this game has been part of my life for forever. I can just cry on command. Dying in a dungeon right before your ally is about to kill the bosses and get the big drop. Well, if you stay in it, I think you get this drop still. You used to not though, but I think you do now. Getting muted for 10 years. Um, bitch, get out of here. Why is she following me? Anyway, let me know what makes you cry in Wizard 101 because I'm pretty sure we've all cried at least once. Thank you guys for watching. Love you. Bye.